Uh, the next section, we're going to talk about some new technology for um, club DJs. So, uh, in the past, you know, probably a lot of people here have, you know, you take your interface to the club, or you might connect to a rain mixer. Um, but now in Serato DJ, we've got a, a bunch of really club standard mixers that are supported, so you can come and connect directly to the DJM 900 Nexus, um, as well as that you can connect to the DJM 850, the Allen and Heath Zone DB2, DB4, and the new 43C. So these are all supported with a Serato DJ license. So if you have that license, you can turn up to the club and you can plug in directly to these mixers, which will be really easy to find all over the place. So it's really easy once you have the license. Um, if you're using turntables, you'll want to have you need a DVS expansion as well, and uh, that's bundled together with what we call the club kit. So if you use turntables uh, or CDJs with control CDs, you want to look at getting um, the club kit. So once you have that activated, you can do that easily in the MySerato window in the application itself, um, which is just a button in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen, and you can log in and activate all that. You can also activate a 14-day free trial, which is really handy if you haven't sorted yourself out before and you get to the club and you need to use it, and that's um, fully featured. So once you have that license installed, it's super easy. You just connect uh, directly to the 900 with a USB cable, and you'll see it will ask you to install the driver. You click the button and then follow the steps. And it'll take a little minute. Um, the good thing about this is you don't have to be on the internet to install this driver, because it's actually bundled in the installer itself when you have DJ, so you don't need to be <coughs> online to do that. Yeah. Cool. So now that's done, and um, you'll see the virtual decks pop up. So everything's uh, pretty much good to go now. The only other thing we want to check is we want to go into the setup screen. And we want to uh, go into the audio tab, and we want to check our inputs. So we can select that there, and that's going to open up the driver panel. We want to go to Mixer Output. And depending on what we have, what we set up, we're going to choose basically what we want. So if we have turntables on the outside channels, we're going to select Phono for those. And then for the inside channels, if we're using CDJs, we'll choose CDJ or Line. Um, the 900 Nexus itself only has Phono inputs on the outside channels. So because of that, we have to then um, go back into the setup screen of Serato DJ, and you'll see that we've got um, two primary DEX options. So usually you have your regular DEX setup, which is one, two, three, four, from left to right. And if, you know, if the, you've got four CDJs plugged in, and the way that they have the club CDJs, the inside CDJs are connected to one and two, the left-hand channels, then you'll want to be using um, that channels one and two primary DEX option. But if you're using turntables and you've got you're plugged in, obviously, to the phono inputs on uh, outside channels. You'll want to be using um, this primary deck option here, which means that your outside channels are going to be your main ones where the turntables are, which are going to actually be um, three and four. So then if you go back into the main screen of Serato DJ, you'll then have to switch to three and four just using that. And you can also just hit the tilde key on your keyboard to switch between one and two and three and four. The only other thing to note with this mixer is if you use Serato Video. So if you use Serato Video and you have faders mapped or you have anything that requires MIDI from the mixer, um, you actually have to turn that on on the mixer. So as you can see now, it's not, there's nothing mapped. And as soon as we press MIDI on on the mixer, which is in the top left, you can see that fader will be mapped now. So it's really straightforward, and it's, um, that's how you can connect to the 900 in the club pretty easily. Thank you.